It's pretty crazy because I've known her for well over a decade. Yo, I was just chilling in my whip and I looked up in the sky and saw this beauty. Damn, that's life. <laughs> what's good everybody welcome to another video you know who it is it's the boy triz and as you can see there i'm having my first meal of the day it is currently 9 15 in the morning i did my morning cardio already earlier um 50 minutes on the stairmaster and now i'm just getting this meal down today is gonna actually be <laughs> one of the most eventful days that i've ever had and it's not even that crazy so i'm gonna eat this meal and i should really just devour it and leave but i got athletic therapy in 45 minutes and then I'm gonna go to the outlet mall. I'm gonna try find some white sneakers for the gym, you know? I just want some white shoes. And then I also need to get a new chair for my desk in my room so that I can sit there and work and whatever, whatever, right? <laughs> so that's eventful for me, okay guys? I'm still on prep. And as you saw in the food, the carbs, the rice, they're getting very scarce and cardio is just getting higher and higher. So we're, we're pushing down to the, to the final weeks and it's really gonna be the part that makes or breaks and brings in the conditioning and you know allows me to really elevate myself and, and see if I have what it takes to win a show. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna devour this real quick and I will see you guys later. Thank you for joining in and make sure you hit subscribe and like and maybe share it if you know if you support the boy, okay? What up y'all? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, that's looking really nice. Very symmetric. There you go, man, there you go. Let's see a front double bicep. Boom. There we go, man. Another beautiful day in October, what? All right, guys, so we just finished the session here at Recharge again with my buddy Ryan. I've been coming to see him a little more often than usual because I'm getting ready for the stage, as I told you guys. I want to make sure everything's looking symmetrical because I've had issues with my shoulder and my lat in the past. It's given me issues, and I want to make sure that when I'm going on stage, everything is even, not lopsided, because it's been like that in the past. And I'll just prop up a picture here on the side so you can see, but everything's looking pretty good. Um, it's exactly where we want to be at this point. We're about five weeks out and we're just going to dial in on the conditioning, obviously. Um, but yeah, no, just making sure to have the body ready. And so that when I step on stage, I can bring the best possible package and nothing is holding me back. So I could say that I did what I can do to get that number one spot because you know what? We're coming for that number one, man. Nothing less. What are we doing this for? What are we grinding for? That's what it is. You guys can also tell that every time I do a session like this, like, my voice is all chill, I'm raspy. It's cause like when I'm laying there, it's like over an hour session, right? Almost an hour and a half and it just gets really like relaxing and sometimes I'm like borderline falling asleep. It's it's, rela it's good It's and sometimes it's painful because it depends what we're doing. But um, at the end, you know, we kind of put on the electrotherapy, whatever shock therapy and I, I kind of like doze off a little bit. So I'm just waking back up now. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead to the mall now and um, try to find my shoes. I keep that thing on me, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We here. Through the night. <laughs> she just wanted to drop. I've never seen these before. But these are pretty nice. If only they were in white, because I came for white shoes. These are nice, though. She got a car in now. I don't think that you should work tomorrow. She said, first of all, I'm still going in like rich, homie. Yeah, with you and me, God, man, it feels so intense. I already seen that movie, but I will go again with you. I got a few I've been tending to, but tonight, I forgot all about them. I don't know, guys, the Adidas selection is kind of lacking. Number three. Third time to try, maybe? Okay, hold up. The Rock is doing his thing. Okay, Dwayne. I see Dwayne. They're pretty nice. Like, it's definitely a nice shoe. 
minus the boys, but I'm cool now. Look at my common sense, and I'm just realizing this. No, my soul is in trap, but what's holding me back is the old me effect. I'm gonna get it. I don't know, man. It's nice, but I don't know if it's what I'm looking for. Oh, oh no, not the not the new balances. Oh, they don't know about this new. Hold up. One eternity later. So I'm a simple guy, so I resorted to one of the shoes I saw and I checked this whole damn outlet mall. I couldn't find nothing. I want a plain white shoe. A plain white shoe with no accents of any other color on it, just straight white. So I'll show you guys what I'm just going to cop right now. There you go. Nice and simple. All white chucks. You can never go wrong. And I'm just using these for the gym. Be chilling. All right, so we got what we wanted. I got the chucks, the white chucks, and I ended up copying the gray nikes as well, just because they were so cheap, you know, why not? Might as well get them too. But um, I'm pretty hungry. I'm gonna save the chair shopping for later. I'm gonna go home and eat because I am starving, man. And the starving just, it just doesn't stop. We'll see if I end up going chair shopping. When I get home, I might just want to stay in hiding and just not go nowhere, <laughs> but we'll see. Alrighty, but it's a nice day, as you guys could see. Oh, what a lovely day it was out here today. Let's play football out here, bro. Yeah, it's, okay. it's big enough. You know? Rasta, man. Never even invite nobody. Smitty's is I'm a though. simple so guy. I'm not gonna lie about that. Yo, I hate Smitty's. I remember this one time I went and I got like hot wings and it was just fucking trash. I don't know. After that, I was like, I'm never going to Smitty's ever again in my life. Like Smitty's or uh, or uh, Tav too. Even t that's all. Tra Maybe I'm a wing snob or something, man. Little Bones is. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna leave it there. Little Bones. Little Bones is the one, man. Maybe I just had bad experiences because even when I went to Tavern one time too, it was the same thing. I got like yeah, some shitty hot. One wings. experience can kill it. Like you yeah, it makes me like never want to go back again. Buying fucking used vehicle. Yeah. That shit looks fire. That looks really good, man. Yeah. Smells good too. <laughs> We're out there talking about like hot wings, pizza, and all that good food, but you know, I definitely still, still stay on point. Always. Right now we're focused. It's fucking rowdy down there, huh? And of course we got the good old Cholula. Green pepper, major money. Am I ever order stuff? Yeah, don't be touching all the wings eh, when you're going. We trying to match the shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's it for me. How much history? It's a couple of washing feathers. How many? You get the first down there. I want two blue cheese. That makes five blue cheese. You want blue cheese? One more cheese. All right, so I'm leaving early, guys, because you know what? I try to go out. I try to see my people, but it's just getting really fucking hard right now because, like, my calories are low. My my fucking cardio is high, my workouts, you know, it's just, and you see the food, it's just, it's just getting too hard, guys. It's just getting too hard and it's just gonna make it harder for me and when I could be focusing on my prep, I gotta do everything that's gonna make it as easy as possible because you can't slip up right now. And it's frustrating. Sometimes it's just frustrating. <laughs> but yo, we're still good. We gonna keep it moving. And once we're done, we can like wild out, do whatever we need to do. We have a little more flexibility, more freedom. Um, but I'm out here now. See you later. What's going on, everybody? So I am currently heading to the park. Today's my best friend's wedding, but I couldn't attend the ceremony for complications I don't really want to talk about. I really wanted to be there, but I couldn't. So I'm just going to go meet them at the park where they have finished the ceremony, and I'm going to go say what's up, take some pictures, whatever, whatever. You see how I got a little some light, some light going on. You feel me? You feel me? We got some light going on. It's pretty crazy because I've known her for well over a decade. And I couldn't be a part of this ceremony, which is such like a, a once in a lifetime thing. A wedding only happens once, but you know what? I wanna at least say what's up and congratulate the, the bride and the groom. I'll let them know that I'm there in spirit. <laughs> well, as you can see, I have to stop at the liquor store because the bride is thirsty. Yesenia Carolina Garcia, I keep calling her the bride because it's her big day today, but got her some bottles there. 
As for me, I have a Coke Zero vanilla flavor. This is actually so good right now. Like, it's a treat. I still try not to drink them too often, even though it's zero calories, whatever. Man of the yeah, hour, the man of the day. How how are the vows? <laughs> how are the vows? Man, the vows are <laughs> Corinthians. <laughs> Corinthians got me. Yeah. <laughs> and the bride. There she is with the spin. Hey. <laughs> Boy, thanks for waiting and Hello. coming. I'm trying to make sure y'all speeches aren't like, oh hey, my god. <laughs> how dare you disrespect me like that? What are these little hooligans up to back here? Mischief. Mischief. <laughs> everybody man it's been a hot minute since i picked up the phone to do this vlogging thing you know what i'm like a little under three weeks from my bodybuilding competition so i've been exhausted and you know what i haven't really wanted to record my workouts because my workouts are really important right now and just to set up the phone find the angles yada 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 it just takes away from that you know what i mean but we back we back with the vibes we back with the business and you know what i'm actually gonna hit a back workout today so we gonna get it done you know it doesn't matter how exhausted we are i just want to be able to see this journey look back at it see where i was at where my mindset was my mentality my energy whatever all that stuff you can <laughs> i don't even know man but look we about to kill another session because we always come with the vibes the energy and we gonna kill it let's go and i'm gonna keep going man that's one thing about me, man, I never quit. I go hard, and I never go home, nigga. It's 10 times 10 lifestyle, what you think? Give my whole life to this game. Give my whole life to the streets. Give my whole life to this pain. Give my whole life to these beats. Give my whole life to this, yeah, yeah. I give my whole life to this. I give my whole life to this, yeah, yeah. I give my whole life to this. Give my whole life to this game. Give my whole life to these streets. Give my whole life to this pain. Give my whole life to these beats. Give my whole life to this, yeah, yeah. I give my whole life to this. I give my whole life to this, yeah, yeah. I give my whole life to this. Give my whole life to this gang. Give my whole life to the block. Yeah. Give my whole life to a kitchen. Give my whole life to a pot. Yeah. Give my whole life to this pain. Yeah. Give my whole life to the struggle. Give my whole life to the same shit. Give my whole life to the hustle. Give my whole life to the trap. Yeah. Give my whole life to a dream. Give my whole life to that fast money. Give my whole life to the cream. Come from a place where they breaking it down. If you ain't about it, they breaking you down. Don't do no talking, we ain't make a sound. That's what we do when the cops come around. The streets be so crazy, they get a hold on you like the guillotine. Started from the bottom, then we level up to water whipping in that triple beam. Streets be so cold, and most people fall. They ain't never got no love for you. Streets be so cold, and most people fall. Well, that is it, folks. And not only did we have a good workout, but we also recorded it. Got it done. So, I just finished 50 minutes of cardio post workout. I'm completely exhausted. I'm ready for bed. But I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna have a protein shake, cookies and cream, because I can't have Oreos yet. And as I said, you guys, you know what? We're like three weeks away from my first competition, my bodybuilding competition. And to be honest, all I'm really doing is focusing on prep. So there's not really a lot of action. I stopped going out. I stopped, you know, doing anything else except for focusing on my prep because it's getting really deep. And I can't be around food because I'm just hungry. Hell, I'm hungry. I'll tell you guys. So you know what? 
All I can say is I will see you guys when I see you. If you watch this video, of course, thank you for tuning in once again. You know what's up. Stay active, stay real, and always stay vibey. We out. Through the night. She just want to tip, no advice. On the side of the road, what's the risk? Roll the dice. If they catch us, I don't care, cause we all gonna die.